Welcome. In front of the Huawei MatePad 10.4 and today I'll show you how to transfer files from your device to a SD card and vice versa. And to get started, you want to find the files application. Once you open it up, you will have the categories right here. I'm going to disregard the update. And in the categories, you have the internal storage, which is the storage of the device itself, and then the SD card below that. So let's open one of those. And both of them should have almost identical folder structure. Uh, and I'll go over a couple of folders that might be of importance to you. So one would be the DCIM folder right over here. And this will contain pictures, videos that I have captured with the device. And below that is a downloads folder, which contains anything that I have downloaded. Now there's also a pictures folder right here that contains screenshots. And that's about all the important things. So anyway, once you find your files, which I'm gonna be using this as an example, all you need to do is select them and you do so by holding the file. So you see, once you hold it, it gets that checkbox and then you can tap on additional ones to select more. Once you have selected your files, choose to either copy it or move it, depending on which one you want. Um, they will have different outcomes. So if you move it, they will be completely removed from where they are right now but copy will just create duplicate files. So I'm gonna go with move. And from here, once you have selected one of the options, you wanna back out to where you want to uh, move the files to. So to do so, you can see these this categories that we are right here. So internal uh, storage, pictures, screenshots. So I'm gonna tap on the, believe. Nope, not like that. Let's try that again. Oh, there we go. That's right here. So other location. That's that's how we get to a different uh, location. So from here, as you can see, we have the internal storage, which the files are right now on, and then the SD card below that, which is what I'm going to select. Now, just to make it clear, uh, when I go into the pictures folder right here, it's completely empty, just so you know. And I can drop those files wherever I want on the SD card. Now, I'm not going to bother going into folders. So I'm just going to press move, and this will drop them right at the bottom. And that is how you can move any kind of file. So, if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.